We've been warning you for years about how the TSA is nothing more than a bunch of unprofessional pervs shoving you through the nude body scanners. They're going to abuse their authority. And now an ex-TSA agent is speaking out and he says, yes, I was looking at you naked and we were laughing. The agent had written to the New York Times, following that knee-jerk response by the TSA to employ the nude body scanners after the underwear bomber made it onto the plane, Gee, I wonder how he did that with his FBI escort. Now, the agent went on to explain how he hated his job from the beginning. And in fact, most TSA agents hate their job. They know it's a useless waste of taxpayer money and an abuse of the population. The agent explained how he hates patting down the crotches of children, the elderly, and even infants. He was requ required to confiscate nail clippers from airline pilots with the logic being that those pilots were going to use the nail clippers to hijack their very plane they were flying. And he said a very low moment was when he had to confiscate a celebratory bottle of champagne from a group of Marines who were coming home from Afghanistan. One of the men had lost both his limbs to an IED, and he had to tell that man that, I'm sorry, although you risk your life for the security of this country, I've got to take away your celebratory champagne in the name of national security. Now, he also revealed how the selective list that was causing a lot of racial profiling issues, he said it was a purely political list because there was no need for the enhanced screening for anyone from Saudi Arabia or Pakistan, which are states historically known to harbor, aid, and abet terrorists. Now, of course, it's all political. It's all an opportunity for abuse of power and control. It has nothing to do with terrorism. We've been saying this from day one. We've been saying they'd be looking at your nude scanners and that, yes, indeed, there was a little bit more radiation than they had hoped for. But no, everything's fine. They're just there to keep us safe. And now that the Super Bowl is upon us, the TSA 